So I just showed you in the previous lesson the awesome power of that dimensions tab and being able to look at data and sort it by where are all the activities coming from, geographic, location, by keyword, everything else. But one of the things I showed you was being able to sort the data by time and specifically by hour so you can see where all the conversions are coming from. Now, you'll also see that the correlations between different trends also happen by day of the week. So it's not just by hour. You'll see maybe that certain work days, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, get you higher quality and more profitable traffic and conversions. And if that's the case, then you want to, for some keywords at least, schedule them to only run, those ads to only show, during those times where the most profitable conversions happen. Because the more we can cut the fat, as I like to say, and get rid of the stuff that doesn't perform as well, we can really optimize our profit and make more money. So we'd want to have ads showing only on certain days, or we can also notice certain time intervals when the ads get the best clicks or when they get the most conversions. So let me show you how you can actually set that up in AdWords to have certain ad groups and campaigns only show during certain times or certain hours. So what you wanna do is you go into a specific campaign and then you go up to the top to, to edit its main feature. So under type, search network only, all features, or if it's standard, you need to on that page put it onto all features at the top like I showed you to do. When you do that, you get those advanced features at the bottom. And one of them is schedule, start date, end date, and ad scheduling. If we go into that, it shows when the campaign was started. It has no end date, so it's just running indefinitely until we stop it. But for ad scheduling, it's currently set to showing ads all the time. Now, if we click view ad schedule, it's going to load a page here. And it's going to show us you know, where the ad is currently scheduled to be shown, these ads in this campaign. Now, currently we don't have any controls, so it's just set to wide open. It's gonna show the ads all the time for all the activity in this campaign. But if we wanna be able to set up specific schedules for ads, we can click add an ad schedule. So we do that, and then we create a custom schedule. And so you create these pockets of time or by days uh, inside this ad schedule. So let's say we want to do two things. We want to limit things by the day to only Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And on those days, we only want the ads to be shown between 10 a.m. and noon. So that would be 10 a.m. and 12 p.m. So we'd say, okay, ads, let's do Tuesday. And let's do it from 10 a.m. And you have to make sure, by the way, whatever your time zone is for this account, it's set to Los Angeles and it says it can't be changed. Your, yours might be different if you're in a different location and AdWords allowed you to, to, you know, to set the time zone to, to yours, to something different. Well, then you would go by your time zone and your data. But remember, if you are targeting things in a different country, a different time zone, you'll see maybe what's there 3 a.m. may be your noon. But wherever the data is happening, according to your time schedule and your reports, is is where you want to set the scheduling. Uh, so when the time in the data, I mean, where it shows. So you, you got to make sure to make those correlations because whatever the data shows, it's all based on the time zone in your account, not based on the time zone, uh, you know, where the ad is showing. So when you add up a ad schedule, it's still your time zone you're working with because that's where the data set. Anyway, so we're going to do Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, 10 a.m. to noon. So we do 10 a.m. We'll do 12, 12 p.m., which is noon. So we've got that. So you see Tuesday, 10 a.m. to 12. So we're going to add this. Now we're going to do Wednesday, 10 a.m., 12 p.m. We'll add one more, Thursday, 10 a.m. And you can only do this at the campaign level. So this is another reason why to take some of your valuable keywords and move them into their own campaigns. So after we do that, we save. And now we can see that these are the ad schedules and we can see on this little chart up here, this is when they're the ad is actually scheduled to be shown. And we can even set bid adjustments by the times uh, for each one of these segments, we can do a bid adjustment, a percentage change up or down uh, if we wanna do that. So for example, why this is important if you find you have a time zone where you'd a time area a block of time where you'd still like to run the ad but you don't want to pay as much because the traffic doesn't convert as high or it's not worth as much you can still run the ad 
and you can still skills excuse me you can still schedule it to run during those times but you can set the bid adjustment so you're paying less during those times and then you'll pay more or the regular rate with no bid adjustment during the times that you choose but this is it so we added these ad schedules we have tuesday wednesday thursday now 10 a.m to noon and for all the ad groups in this campaign that's the only times that our ads are going to show. They're not going to show in any of these other times because we've set up this custom ad schedule. So as you can imagine, this is very, very powerful. This is called day parting. It's a very powerful concept to be able to control when your advertisements show based on days of the week or and or times of the day. If you combine these both, you'll find that you can turn losing unprofitable campaigns into winners, into profitable campaigns by narrowing it down to just a few days a week and of course, by a few hours of the day. Some campaigns, you want them to run every day and 24 hours a day, but others, you'll really want to control it and you'll really find that you'll, you'll, find that you, you'll need to control it, otherwise you can't make money. So this is how you do it. You set up ad scheduling at the campaign level and you put in when you want the ad to be shown. Very powerful. And of course, being able to adjust the bids up or down during any of those blocks you set up too is also very powerful.